Hey everybody, Joe here. I am back again, and it's once again time to open up some retro game treasure. What's inside this month's box? Let's find out. For those of you who are not familiar, Retro Game Treasure is one of those monthly subscription box deals. You pay a certain amount of money, they send you some games, you can send them a wish list, you can tell them what you have, and it all kind of works out. And sometimes they send you some pretty good stuff. Let's see what they sent me this time around. So let's open this bad boy up. Let's throw the packing material out. And we got four games and uh, Good variety here, I think. I'll start with these two handhelds. Start with the original Game Boy version of Battletoads. I don't think I have this. I'm pretty sure I don't have this. Uh, I know I did check off the wish list, and I'm pretty good about updating my wish list when I find stuff. And that's pretty cool that I have that. And another one. This is this is actually pretty cool. This is actually something, I think this was on my wish list, as a matter of fact. That is Pinball of the Dead. If you're familiar with, like, uh, Devil's Crush, it plays a little bit like that, just it has, like, House of the Dead kind of visual themes on it. So you're you know, flipping your ball at zombies, which is pretty neat. And then, okay, the two things that are left, I'll go with the Genesis game. And I know I have the other one, but here is Jurassic Park. Rampage Edition. Not too sure about the difference. I guess this one's a little bit more rampaging. Not a big fan of any of the Jurassic Park games. I mean, the overhead Super Nintendo and NES games are okay, but the side-scrolling ones for the Genesis, kind of bleh. And this is kind of neat. Last game I'm showing you here is a Famicom title called Door Door kind of a platforming puzzle game where you're being chased like monsters and uh, you open doors and try to lure them into the doors to clear the stages. It's kind of fun, kind of neat. I've played this before. I think it's on one of the multi carts that I have or one of the Famiclones built in, something like that, one or the other. And it's kind of neat. And there you have it. There are the four games that we have on this month's Retro Game Treasure Box. I think it's pretty darn good. I know uh, Video Games Monthly has been killing it the last two boxes. Uh, in about a week, give or take, I probably will be getting my next VGM box and we'll see what they send me. But all in all, this is one of the better Retro Game Treasure boxes I think I've seen in a while. I mean, nothing outrageous, but some pretty cool looking games. Uh, I know. There's three things out of the four, which I am very pleased with. I mean, like I said, Door Door is pretty fun. Battletoads is always a cool game. And lastly, Pinball Dead is sounds awesome. And my dog is barking, so let me go see what he needs. Hope you've enjoyed this uh, unboxing. Now, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Take care.